All right, hello everyone. Good to see you again. So this is the 8th of December, 2002 Tuesday, and this is a recorded video. So um, today I will talk about the Ichimoku Kinko Hyo because every Tuesdays and Thursdays are actually Ichimoku basic lecture series. So I will talk about the Tenkan Sen and Kijun Sen. So let's get started. As a quick disclaimer, um, this information is basically based on my experience, experience knowledge. So when you take tries, please do with your own risk. So I have been using Ichimoku Kinko Hyo for the last five years and it's becoming uh, one of my strategies and I read the original books of Ichimoku in Japanese and I will try to um, give you as much information as possible in this YouTube live stream and if you know want to know the depth deeper level of Ichimoku then I run the Ichimoku community here so you can click on the description below and uh, you can come to the Ichimoku community to join so today's topic is about the Tenkan Sen and Kijun Sen here. So Tenkan Sen and Kijun Sen are actually the backbone of Ichimoku Kinko Hyo because originally there were only Tenkan Sen and Kijun Sen. There were no Kumo, there were no Chikou Span originally. And because the Kumo Chikou Span are actually the supportive lines to Tenkan Sen and Kijun Sen. So that's why they are called Senko Span B, Senko Span A, and Chikou Span. These are the spans and not the um, kin Ichimoku Kinko Hyo as a part of the main part of Ichimoku Kinko Hyo. So, um, so that means if you understand the essence of Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen, then basically you master the Ichimoku by itself. So that's why Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen are the most important lines among these five lines of Ichimoku. And today, I would like to talk about the cross of Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen, what it means. So, simply put, the cross of Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen means that this is the end or the end of uptrend downtrend in a short to mid term. Uh, because um, in my ch color, um, chart setting here, the Tenkan Sen is a blue one, and the Kijun Sen is a green one. And um, you see the Tenkan Sen, initially, the Tenkan Sen gold cross all the way back here there was a gold cross Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen and the market went up all the way and after that it became dead cross over here so this is a Euro CAD chart on the 13th of April there was a dead cross of Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen so on this day exactly on this candlestick right here this means that this is the end of the uptrend after this gold cross of Tenkan Kijun Sen this is the end of the uptrend in a short to mid-term because Tenkan Sen shows the short-term equilibrium the Tenkan Sen shows the short-term equilibrium and the Kijun Sen shows the mid-term equilibrium and what I mean by short-term mid-term uh, that is, is, not, um, is not what I mean by the time frames the terms in terms of um, the period in a certain time period on this one time frame. So this is a daily chart and the Tenkan Sen shows Tenkan Sen calculates the previous highs high and low for the last nine candles and it takes the mid price. And Kijun Sen takes the last 20 candles in the past and it takes the mid price. So in this daily chart this is the equilibrium point in the short term and the Kijun Sen shows the equivalent point in the midterm. And what it means by the cross, like here on the dead cross, is that this is the end of the uptrend in the short to midterm. Tenkan Sen end, Kijun Sen here. So this is where you don't want to look for buy or sell chance anymore because um, most likely the market can range or it might break the Kumo downwards. So that's one of uh, the most important information about the cross. So ever since the Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen dead cross here, it's been dead crossing and it never gold cross and the market went down afterwards. So market broke the Kumo downwards and continuously moving down this way. So what can happen next is that if you focus on the Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen, uh, they're gonna gold cross 
as the market retraces backwards this way, then you will see the Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Gold Cross. So if you step further, a bit more here, you see the Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Gold Cross. So exactly on this day of uh, 1st of July this year, uh, this was the end of the downtrend after this uh, Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, Dead Cross. This is the end of the downtrend in the short to mid term. So after this, after you see the gold cross, you don't want to look for the sell chance anymore. So as the market goes on, um, it became a another dead cross here. So from the dead cross, you can look for the sell chance. Especially this dead cross is very significant because it happens below the Kumo here. So Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, dead cross. Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, dead cross, I just put TSD below Kumo below Kumo is very significant in this case this is not only the beginning of the downtrend in a short to mid term but also this is below the Kumo meaning that this is in the long term this is bearish too Kumo shows the bearish equilibrium and bearish trend direction and when the price is below the Kumo this is the downtrend in the long term and also, while so while the market is downtrending in the long term, you see the dead cross of Tenkan Kijun Sen, the beginning of the downtrend. Mm -hmm. Sorry, beginning of the downtrend in um, the short to mid term. So we can expect the market continue to go down this way after this dead cross. And what happens is that the market keeps going down this way. So after that. The market, if the, as the market retraces backwards, then the Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen will gold cross, and this will be the end of the downtrend in a short to mid term. So let me forward until it happens. All right, so over here, we see Tenkan Sen, Kijun Sen, gold cross exactly on the 17th of September. This was the end of the downtrend. Then you stop looking for the sell chance anymore. So yeah, this is the essence of the Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen cross. <clears throat> so once again, um, the cross Tenkan Sen Kijun Sen cross means this is the beginning or the end of the trend in a short to mid term. And when you see that cross below the Kumo, then that will be very significant. And also when you see gold cross above Kumo, that is also significant indication for the continuous downtrend. So exactly in this example here, exactly from this day the 17th of july um, you can start to look for the sell chance in uh, in uh, lower time frames all right so i hope you liked today's video about tenkan sen kin sen cross so tomorrow will be another recorded video and i will talk about how to capture the trend based on my strategy called kts case trading strategy so ichimoku kinko hyo Ichimoku basic lecture and KTS are actually two different um, services that I do. On Ichimoku lecture, I mainly talk about the five lines and three theories of Ichimoku. But on this KTS strategy, this is purely my based on my experience, more simplified version of Ichimoku and how to capture trends, how to uh, how to um, analyze multiple time frames, and where to enter exit break even and such so and if you want to master Ichimoku as today's topic then you can come to my website you can click in the below description and come to my website and uh, come to services and click on this Ichimoku community and this is where you can find all the information uh, recently I have recorded a video and you can uh, watch this uh, introductory video too uh, for this case Ichimoku community so you get these perks two books that I wrote that are available for Ichimoku members and you get um, 10 perks including these two two uh, perks the books you get these uh, 10 perks as you can join so um, I hope you enjoy this uh, Ichimoku community page and if you wish to learn the essence more deeper level of Ichimoku, then please join. I will be waiting for you on the Ichimoku community. So tomorrow, once again, 
I will talk about how to capture the trend based on my strategy KTS. So let me go back to the home page. Hold on. And scroll down a bit. Then you can find the everyday topic. So tomorrow is going to be the ninth uh, trend strategy by KTS. And it's going to be a recorded video. So I hope you enjoy tomorrow's video too. So I will see you on tomorrow's video or the live stream on Thursday. So until then, please stay healthy and stay gold. Have now. Matane. Thank you.